there's a difference between a neighborhood buffer and a neighborhood snowball. A buffer protects the neighborhood, doesn't snowball it into, look at this, this is not even gonna smack yourself when you take a left. This is the development, y'all, this is the, the street. A buffer would be a green space to protect the neighborhood from more traffic, not create a scenario where there's more traffic. I'm done now for the day. Can y'all hear the crickets right now? And see how dark it is? Part of that's probably not cool. It should be better lit. But you can hear crickets. And you can kind of see the stars. That's not gonna happen if this old abandoned, moldy, asbestos-ridden school is torn down for a, a development of apartments and a hotel. I mean, this is a residential neighborhood, y'all. Watch your step. It says, hey, y'all, I'm right where the proposed development is. Do you see how quiet it is right now? Okay, y'all, this is a residential neighborhood. How city staff could feel that this would be a perfect fit is beyond me. It's almost like y'all just take words and you do a mashup in your little memos. It's like y'all have a, a program and you just put a street in and bingo, it just says the words. I don't understand how any form or fashion a poet's corner or retail would be appropriate here. Scott Gregson, you know these cats. I sure hope you talk about leaving downtown. This is not part of your shenanigan. Otherwise, you need to recuse yourself.